two young girls get stuck with a dirty needle playing outside a local school. Those children were taken to the hospital to be tested and treated. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Lisa Hughes. And I'm Leah Martin. Tonight, parents, of course, are concerned for their kids' safety. Mike LaCrosse is in Arlington, where the town is taking immediate action. The Arlington superintendent says that staff at all of the district schools will be doing extensive and scheduled searches around the buildings to make sure there are no more needles. Parents in Arlington are disturbed learning two young girls were accidentally stuck with a hypodermic needle while playing outside during a recreation department program. It's scary, but hopefully everything's okay. Arlington police say a five-year-old girl and seven-year-old girl were playing outside the Gibbs Middle School around four this afternoon when they found the syringe. One of the girls got stuck picking it up. The other also got stuck trying to help remove the needle from her friend. Both were taken to Winchester Hospital for tests and treatment. Honestly, I would have never thought of it as something I have to worry about. Arlington's superintendent releasing a statement about the situation tonight, saying it is extremely concerning that a hypodermic needle would be so carelessly disposed of on the ground of a school where children constantly gather, walk, and play. Parents are hoping this is an isolated incident. I think uh, any parent's going to be concerned of the, for their kids' safety, but um, here in our community, it's relatively rare. Testing will be done on the needle to see if the girls need any more treatment. Meanwhile, tomorrow, the superintendent and police chief will meet with other town officials to see what else can be done to address the problem. Reporting from Arlington, I'm Mike LaCrosse, WBZ News.